why do we advocate for connecting up high level and point one simultaneously in theater? Two reasons, and it's really simple. First of all, everything we do is lived full range. Theater is supposed to be full range. So your center channel, which is what a typical average center channel speaker is perhaps this wide, it can't possibly get down to the 20 hertz region. So what we've developed is ways to augment and, and enhance a very limited bandwidth device and turn it into something that can get into the 20 hertz range, 25, 26 hertz, easily for not a lot of money. But then there's this matter of the LFE channel, also known as a 0.1 channel. Low frequency effects are special, typically very loud, very high dynamic, bombastic inputs that are used to sell science fiction thrillers, m you know, movies about uh, the military, anything that requires loud, explosive, deafening effects. And we have the ability to do both simultaneously. So if you think of the high level as nothing more than full range, take high level and anything you may think about it out of it. it. It allows you to transform a speaker that can't make bass into a full range speaker, times five or seven, nine or 11. And at the same time, it has the ability to deliver the special effects of a 0.1 LFE channel that are used to create the ultra bass that sort of sells the drama of a big science fiction thriller. The other really important attribute to doing what we do, where we advocate for using high level that transforms limited bandwidth speakers into full range speakers and a point one, as the signal demands in theater, is that very few of us are listening to high blown, really dynamic theater 24 hours a day. Most of us use our systems and want to use our systems for a variety of different applications. And it's so beautiful to be able to go from a big piece like that and the entire family is sort of sitting there going, oh my gosh, that like I'm exhausted from the drama of that. And with the high level circuit in, it's already been tuned perfectly using music, you're able to just go back to anything you want slip in a piece of classical music to sort of start to calm everybody down. And the REL is doing its job beautifully, intuitively. You didn't have to touch another control. There's no remote controls. It's one of the reasons we don't put remote controls with our product for the most part, because once you set it properly, you can forget it. And it allows this seamless use of the entire entertainment system to do everything that everybody wants and intuitively a system to do.